the invisible hours coming to you April the 24th now this key was provided to us for free to show you a preview but it no way influences our thoughts verdicts opinions or what not 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 hurrah so let's check out the invisible hours for all the information I gotta do is click show more below the video it can tell you everything from developer publisher price to release and let's go all right, okay. Let's, wee no scope seven twenty hashtag yo though. Let's go. Grab your ticket. Let's put the ticket in the slot. So on the tutorial, we won't show too much of this game. We don't want to spoil it. Okay. See. Did we break it? All right, we got it. Oh, wow, we can teleport and everything. Yeah, boys, look at me. This is the invisible hours. Let's teleport. It's got options. <laughs> And of course, we need the subtitles. Yes, lovely, beautiful. And we are ready for our debut in the Invisible Hours. I don't know what I'm talking like that for. I just wanted to troll, but whatever. Welcome. This is not a game. This is not. God damn it. I... Truth is a matter of perspective, especially dual perspectives. Are we loading or what? What's going on? Eh? Not like we used to be up there, now we're down here, we're in the theatre. We're in the amphitheatre. And obviously we're doing pretty bad. Now this game is originally released in VR. And uh, they've obviously gone in there. Released it onto normal console. Now I, I don't know. There we go. Now, let's go. Wow, we, we got like a... Wee. Sorry, let's just play. Let's uh, kind of resume what's going on here. Let's listen to this bloke. Ah, hello. Greetings, sir. Let me take this from you. Lovely. Open the dossier. Nope. Dilla. Let me take that. Captain, when are you coming back? Captain. Hey, hey, rewinds. Hey, Captain, when are you coming back? Captain. All right. Well, go on, look at that me. me. Whoa, me. So I don't have a clue what I'm doing in this game at all. So we're just gonna continue with not having a clue. Oh, we shouldn't have paused time there. Whee! Okay. Drat, I was going to try and uh, kind of teleport in. If I can't. Looks like one of those games where you got to know what to do to... Oh, no, never mind. The doors are open. So we just walk in. Greetings. Oh, God, somebody's dead. Oh, jeez. There's a gun. Can we rewind? So 
So he has the power to rewind time, so why can't you just stand here and rewind time and just see who did it? There's a gun. There's a knife. This guy did it. No. It's the first car I come across to be did it. Obviously there's some sort of way to uh, kind of... Yeah, alright then. Oh, look at this, it's me. Meow. Hi guys. I'm a cat. Uh, uh. Ooh. We talk to him? No, we can't talk to them. It's a mystery. Ooh. Nope. Can we talk to this guy? No. We can't talk to no one. What we can do is pick this up and read it. Come, my friends. It is not too late to seek a newer world. Push off, and sitting well in order smite the sounding furrows. For my purpose holds to sail beyond the sunset, and the paths of all the western stars, forever. Okay, there you go, that was a poem. We found a lovely poem. Can we open this book up? No? Alright. So let's see what's going on with this bloke here. We got a gun. Yeah, let's have a look at a knife. A bludgeon. That looks like some sort of... Looks like a hand. Ah, that's a lever, isn't it? That's a, that is a lever. Lever it alone. It's a gun. I don't know what the f I'm doing. I should carry on pretending to know. Oh, hang on a minute. Hang on. Hang about. Right. La 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 la. Oh, what's this? There's probably some sort of way to open stuff and actually play the game, but I'm too dumb, so what's this? Ooh. Miskatonic University, Arkham Library. Card number 1916. Name, Nikola Tesla. Address, 454 Angel Street, Providence. Book on loan, Necronomicon by Abdul El Hazarit. March 15th, 1937. Okay, that was quite interesting. What's this? I'm going to be saying that about a lot of things, but... Oh, what's this? Oh, what's this? Oh, what's... So, yeah, we're just going to, you know... We're just going to wing it. We're just going to wing it. Shower, lovely. Can we have a shower? No. Nope. Oh, what's... No, shit. Interesting. Smithers. Ooh. Ooh. Indubitably. Let's read this. Mr. Edison, you promised innovation. You promised greatness. Yet ten months after investing in you, we are still left wanting. If you cannot fulfill your obligation to us, do not expect us to fulfill our financial obligation to you. Sincerely, J.P. Morgan. Ooh, Mr. Edison, you're a bit of a naughty boy, aren't you? What's this? Oh, okay. Splendid, splendid. Ooh, what's that over there? Dearest... Letter. Tesla to Edison. Dearest Thomas, let us dispense with euphemism. We both know you did not invent the famous Edison phonograph. It was the work of Louis Le Prince, a man who then took his own life because you stole his life's work. This is the last time I will ask you. Come to the island, or I will tell the world. Thomas, I can make your mistake undone. I blame Roland on Edison. It's all Edison's fault. He came here, he didn't want uh, Tesla to... Uh... I just sold the game, yeah? 
Yeah. We got a motive already. We got one motive. Yes, we got one motive. Oh, look at this, mate. Look at this. We're, we're like 10 steps ahead of them already, aren't we? Look at this. Right, we'll grab you. What does the fox say? Of course we found the fox. I keep accidentally pausing. Oh, we're breaking boundaries right now. I mean, look at this stuff. I mean, come on. It really takes a real kind of... Oh. Ooh. Nikola Tesla. We found this Tesla coil. Which powers the whole island. But we can't do nothing here, I don't think. So, but yeah. Oh, we can teleport in that little crevice. Oh well. Oh, what's this here? Where does he get his ideas? Thomas Edison seems to have more ideas than one man could master. Ask him, and he will tell you he has the mind of ten men hidden inside his remarkable cranium. A charming gentleman, with a wit only matched by his education, Edison puts it all down to sleep. He rests a mere six and a half hours each night. I'm expecting him to say meerkat. Meerkat. Oh, who's this now, eh? You're, you're the, you're the snuggling princess. Are you right? Let's read this. Disgraced Swedish detective quits. Detective Gustav Gustav has taken early retirement from the Swedish police force. Once famous as the inspiration for the mystery novel, the detective so good they named him twice. Gustav is now better known for foolishly releasing his own prime suspect during a murder investigation. Following his recent divorce and financial troubles, Gustav is not expected to return I am to Gustav, law enforcement. Gustav. I am Gustav Gustav. I am Gustav. This was actually four years ago. Because you see, it was 1927. I think is the current year. And that was written 1897. So. Sorry, I'll just open my can of kick ass. Ooh, that tastes really nice. Shame I won't be enjoying these anytime soon. Because, you know. Because of. Sugar tax. No. <laughs> and I can't drink sugar free stuff because I. Makes me have a headache and stuff. So we're back here. Um, 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 oh, sorry. Bing. Can we hit the gong? Wait, what? what? Yeah, I mean, that's Adam. I think that's Tesla there, isn't it? Is that Tesla? Yeah, he got murdered. Tesla. I sold it. I'm going home now. Have a good day. Oh, what's this here? Oh, we come across something. I believe this could be yours. Oh dear God, thank you. Thank you, I couldn't bear to lose this. It's very pretty. It's very pretty, so you like you. Mr. Tesla turned you away. Why would he do that? What's your name, sir? My name is Gustav. You're very it's kind. Gustav I'm Gustav. But I'm afraid this is a private matter. Let's follow. Where is it? We can't zoom in, can we? We probably can, but I'm too. Oh. Let's fast forward this. They're going to be like, oh my god, dead person. Open. Mr. Tesla? Now we're cooking with fire. Is he alright? 
Oh, excuse me, but do you really think this guy is okay? Miss. How cold is it, sir? Did that happen recently? What's going on here? Ah, Detective Gustav, I assume. My apologies, I, I didn't hear the bell. You must be exhausted. Sweden is a long way to come from. If you will be so kind as to follow me, I will show you. Post time. So this guy is actually blind. He, I don't know. So he he'll be totally oblivious to all of this that's gone on, but I don't know how he knows his way around. But obviously, you know, yeah. So resume. Stop. Who are you? I, I am Oliver's one, sir. Mister Tesla's manservant. You're his butler. Yes, sir. What happened here? What? What do you mean, sir? Are you blind? Yes, sir. Blind from birth. Besides the three of us, how many people in this house? Four, sir. The plot thickens. Thickens. Call them down immediately. Bang the gong. Sir? You're a detective. Bang the gong right now. No one. Bang it. But he called you detective. It's Gustav Gustavon. Gustav Gustav Gustav. This one, sir. How many exits in this building? Only the front door, sir. But all the windows can be opened from the inside. Yeah, obviously, if you want to get a game, you can just relax and kind of get lost in then. It seems pretty cool, doesn't it? Why the devil is the dinner gong being rung at such an hour? This guy is... Hey! Is he dead? Like, Why is everybody asking that? Hmm. Hmm, let me wonder. Is he dead? <sighs> Thomas Edison. Edison. The yeah, he's the one who did it. Thomas Edison did it. Who are you? My name is Gustav Gustav. Gustav Gustav. That's right. The detective so good they named him fine. Right, listen. Just wind your neck in, right? There's someone's dead down there. Excuse me, someone's dead. Wow. Excuse me. I don't know what kind of detective doesn't recognize the most famous stage. What's going on here? What is going on here? What the hell is going on here? Well, that's lovely. You're an actor and all, but there's a bloke down here who's dead. What's your name? My name is Augustus Vanderberg. I'm Marcus Vanderberg's son. Marcus Vanderberg, the famous railroad magnate. I can't be here. I, I've got to get out of here. Nobody's going anywhere. Well, I can't be here. I mean, what are people going to say? They'll say Tessa had himself an accident. Oh, this was no accident. He died from a blow to his head, and the blood has only started congealing around the edges. Yeah, this only started happened con less than ten minutes ago. What? What does that mean? It means I'm a murder suspect. We all are. We can't leave him like this. I need to mark the time of death. My pocket watch is still on Swedish time. Mr. Edison, you are an American. You have the local time, yes? Why does he look so old? The time, please. Six o'clock. Exactly six. Wait, where is it? Oh, yeah, true. Wait, who? Uh Oh, 
Who the fuck is this? Hey! Stop! Turn around! I'm unarmed. I hope so. For your sake. Face we're gonna have a good uh, close up over the Back shoulder the shot. I think this guy is, you know, he probably plays the wrong time with the wrong place kind of guy. Yeah, he's probably a thief, but I, I feel like this, this guy is actually completely innocent, so. You know, cliches and all that stuff. And cliches say it was the butler who did this, so yeah. Stop. Hope you enjoyed this early kind of preview. Mr. Swan, where's the dining room? That way, sir. And... We have a telephone there too. The plot really thickens. Okay. Well, that was over quickly. Bonsoir, monsieur. I wonder if Tesla has a set of gallows around here somewhere. Nobody's to leave this house. I intend to speak with each of you. Look how he works. Shipping him now, baby. That's far enough. So yeah, the link for this game will be down below. I believe you can pre-order it right now. And uh, you know, it's it's a real mystery. It's kind of unique how you play. Well, you know, you're just a spectator, but it's really cool to watch all of this unfold before you so that's all i'm gonna show i don't want to spoil too much because it's a story heavy game but um apparently oh what's this i am gustav gustavan gustav gustav Ooh. the man in room 3327 wednesday january 8th 1997 last week an unknown serbian born man was found dead in room 3327. Yeah, anyway, sorry, I had to cut that short. <laughs> but yeah, so uh, this is The Invisible Hours, I believe. Did I just mess that up? It is called The Invisible Hours, isn't it? Yeah, The Invisible Hours. More am I like, eh? And uh, yeah, that's it. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't enjoy this video, give it a thumbs down. That's cool. And I quite look forward to playing this one. I do. I really do. I want to see what happens, because I'm, I'm a big sucker for kind of murder mysteries, so... I go, I leave.